Okay, I'm in my organization account, and I'm going to come over and select my organizing content course. I'll click the edit course button, and here is my course. I have two lessons here. We have customer empathy. We have effective meetings, and we're going to talk about how you can organize the content here. So if I hover over the edge of the gadget, I've got some icons here. And anywhere you see these three lines, we call this the hamburger here at Versal. Anytime you see that, that means you can move the content. So if I come over here to the table of contents, I also have a hamburger here. I can grab that. I can drag this so I can rearrange items in my lesson and I can rearrange lessons in my course. So this effective meetings section doesn't really fit with this other lesson. So I want to take it and put it into its own course. And if, again, when I hover over here, I have these check boxes. And so I'm just going to come through here really quickly and we'll select the check boxes. You'll get the green overlay to show that it's been selected. Then I'm going to click copy and copying this is now going to add all those gadgets into that clipboard. So there's a couple of things now that I can do also. I can clear this selection and leave everything intact, or I could do a group delete right over here with this button. And you can see that anything that has the checkbox here that has the green overlay then would be deleted. So if I was only taking maybe half of this and I wanted to get rid of it, then I could do a batch delete there. But I don't have to do that in this particular case because I can also delete the entire lesson from right up here because that's what I want to do in this case. I'm getting rid of this lesson. So we'll go ahead and pretend that I've created a whole new course, but I'm actually just going to add a lesson back in here so I can show you how this paste function works. Just drag this and drop it in, and you've got everything intact right there. And this gadget clipboard perpetuates across your courses. So I could, in fact, close this course out, start a new course, come down to the clipboard, and I would have this icon available. I drag it and drop it, and then all my content would be pasted into my new course. That's it, guys. This week we actually kept it quick.